Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Fearless Floyd Show. As always, I am your host, Fearless Floyd. Today's video, we are going to talk about this rumor out there with Teen Mobile uh, issuing fines after January 1st, 2024 for, you know, various various speech, we'll say that. Uh, I am a T-Mobile subscriber. I uh, have been for about two and a half years, maybe even three. Uh, I've received no notice like this uh, through my app on my phone or through email. So what we're going to do is I'm going to call T-Mobile and I'm going to vet this and I'm going to record it and I'm going to play it for you guys. So uh, give me a second. I'll be right back. So as I pause the video, why don't y'all like, subscribe, share, hit that notification bell. Yeah, share my videos, share them with God and everybody. Um, not looking for viewers, not looking for subscribers, not looking for likes or anything like that. You know, I already know I'm shadow banned, so no big deal there. Um, if you'd like to reach me, the Fearless Floyd Show, yahoo.com, the Fearless Floyd Show across every social media platform, mainly over on Telegram. As you see behind me, I have all kind of holiday packages still going on. So it's still the holidays. So come get these. Come register for this uh, trust class. I had a bunch come in this morning, stacking them up. So I can't wait till we uh, draw that. All right, let me pause for a minute and get ready for uh, the presentation. All right, here is uh, T-Mobile's information from their website. I'm getting ready to give them a call, and we're going to find out. So let me pause the video again. Welcome to teach. Tell me, how can I help you today? Yes, I'd like to speak to a representative. Okay, I'll just need a little more information to get you over to customer care. Are you calling about a payment, need tech support, have a billing question? Or are you calling about something else? Something else. I'll get you right over to someone who can help. Awesome. Please enter or stay. Your account PIN should be at least six digits, oh. but no more than 15. Please enter that account PIN again. Yep, doggy dog. Okay, got it. We care about your experience, so we may record this call. Awesome. Thanks, two of us. So let's go to the room. Huh? Are you a DIYer? Many of the school's customer care users are available on mytmobile.com and the T-Mobile app. You can also check out the T-Mobile support community at community.tmobile.com. You have the power to control everything about your T-Mobile service with the T-Mobile app. Make payments and set up payment arrangements, upgrade your device and services, and find great promotions. 
just to mention a few. Check out the T-Mobile app today. Downloaded the T-Mobile app. The T-Mobile app gives you access to the tools customer care uses for things like setting up a payment arrangement, ordering a new device and accessories, and much more, all within a few clicks. Download the T-Mobile app today. Your T-Mobile community has got your back on a variety of topics. Check out the tips, tricks, and hacks to supercharge your T-Mobile devices and services from fellow T-Mobile customers and customer care at community.tmobile.com. Hey, just checking back in. There's still a wait. Press one to receive a call back or stay on the line and someone from our care team will be with you shortly. Thanks for your patience. Hang tight. See if you can name that song, and someone from our care team will be with you shortly. Hey, some attention. Give us something to believe. Now and then, to get to worry. Because you have been spoken for so long. Though you may not have done anything. Will that be consolation when she's gone? This one boy is good information from a man who's made me say. It's a word of truth from me to see the difference that it makes. It's trusting so, but I trust in you. But sir, I just won't tell you what to do. Tell the world about it. Are you a DIYer? Many of the tools customer care uses are available on mytmobile.com and the T-Mobile app. You can also check out the T-Mobile support community at community.tmobile.com. I am a lineman for the county. 
and I drive the main road. You have the power to control everything about your T-Mobile service with the T-Mobile app. Make payments and set up payment arrangements, upgrade your device and services, and find great promotions, just to mention a few. Check out the T-Mobile app today. And the Wichita line is still on the line. Oh, I need a small vacation. Jesus Christ. But it don't look like I'd me. have an emergency. I'd be stuck out, wouldn't and I? You know that I'll bet they're being bombarded with people from Florida. As I need you more than want you. Lynn Campbell. Have um, you downloaded the T-Mobile app? The T-Mobile app gives you access to the tools customer care uses for things like setting up a payment arrangement, ordering a new device and accessories, and much more. All within a few clicks. Download the T-Mobile app today. Lynn Campbell, one of the most underrated guitarists in the world. I'm hardly mine. Hundreds of songs. I don't know that that was him playing guitar for that artist in the session recordings. Might as well give your you your mobile community has got your back on a variety of topics. Check That's out the tips, tricks, and hacks to supercharge your T-Mobile devices and services from fellow T-Mobile customers and customer care at community.tmobile.com. I'm going to do you all a favor and I'm going to pause this. <laughs> and uh, when they pop on, I'll start. Calling people. Help you? Uh, yes, my name is Floyd Pleasant Tarvin IV, and I am a T-Mobile account holder and have been for quite a while. Um, has there been a recent change to the terms of service? With T-Mobile, because there's a rumor going around that there's new fines for specific texts that don't meet the guidelines of T-Mobile. Actually, this is the first time that I heard that, uh, Floyd, but let me check that um, terms and conditions that sure. was updated. Can you please provide to me? Oh, you were able to authenticate the account. Thank you. Yes. So let me access it. Okay. Thank you so much for being part of the family, Floyd, for three years now. So let me just check the notification. Um, if I may ask, where did you see the advertisement? Is it um it's, via it's, commercial or no? It's nothing from T-Mobile. It's just a posting out there in social media that as of January first, twenty twenty four, the terms of services for T-Mobile now includes fines for, i.e., hate speech or. Uh, any texts about illegal activity, and there's a um, a tier of fines. You know, you're fined X amount of dollars for the first offense, even more the second, even more the third. And whether or not that's true, okay. that's what I'm calling to determine whether or not this is a real thing or something that somebody put out on social media because I would like to tamp it out for T-Mobile. If it is untrue, uh, I do have a YouTube channel and a social media platform and uh i would like to publish a video uh i see thank you um uh, yeah, for right. helping us that's gonna be a free advertisement to us spreading the correct news so thank you for uh providing me that information actually i already heard that yesterday for a um a customer and guess what he ported out his service but we actually don't have that statement here so we are asking the customer, where did he receive that? Or did he receive a text message? Because we don't have any announcement of it, to be honest and right. to be transparent. Yes. So 
Um, he it's actually he's not telling where he uh, that he actually heard the news. So thank you for bringing that to us that you saw it on website, right? On uh, probably I would say Telegram. Telegram. Yeah, it could be face could be Facebook as well. Uh, you know, I'm on every social media platform, every one of them. Instagram, Twitter, right you on Patreon, you name it, I'm on it. So, Understood. yeah. So, um, let me go ahead and check it now, because to be honest, we're already um, escalating that issue, because we don't have actually that type of announcement, to be right. honest. But yeah, let I agree. me go ahead and yeah, provide the details. Because if it's really official, usually we post it on um, commercials, and you should receive text message. But so far, I don't see any announcement yet. But let me coordinate now and report this to our management. Thank you. Uh, especially to the office of the president, because it's really alarming as well for the right. close advertisement. Right. So thank you. Um, just stay and, on and the I line. Tell you, and... Sure. I, when you contact your president, if, they, if he would like to come on and, and speak with me as well, because I am going to publish this video, and I am recording it right now. Uh, uh, if he would like to speak to me and, you know, come on the Zoom or whatever and dispel it or even verbally, uh, yeah, that would be great. Understood. Let me go ahead and coordinate now with them, okay? Thank you. Please stay on the line. Sure, no Thank problem. You. Hold on. All right. Thank you very much for patiently waiting, and I really appreciate your effort. So I was able to verify with the back office team that it's actually not true. So uh, we actually don't have that type of um, implementation uh, next year. But I was able to see it on Google when I typed T-Mobile Terms and Condition Update. So I can see that there will be finding users who commit perceived violations on their bandwidth. But actually, right. it's not coming through T-Mobile. So it's not um, through T-Mobile website as well. So what I can guarantee is it's not true. But I was able to report this also uh, with the help of the back office team from the office of the president. So rest assured, um, I also requested um, if uh, you mentioned that you have a YouTube account, right? Yes. So I also indicated that you're open to be contacted by T-Mobile. So just to make sure, your best contact number is 346-971-6999, correct? That is correct, ma'am. Okay, so usually the update, um, if they were able to, or if the Office of the President reached this, usually they will give uh, back to you by... Uh, January 5th. So it would take okay. three to five business days. Okay. Awesome. So I also sent you my virtual business card. This is an assurance that everything that we discussed today is documented. So rest assured, um, Mr. Floyd, there is no such thing as uh, the fine for, you know, for the hate speech or violation because, of course, we all have freedom of speech. So I don't think T-Mobile should, you know, um, 
invade those type of privacy, uh, especially uh, maybe if it's uh, a violation when it comes to over usage using the phone and right. overseas if they don't have a plan, that will be possible. But if that's because of the hate speech or anything that you know said about uh, against T-Mobile or you know against anybody, I don't think T-Mobile should handle that problem. So rest Absolutely. assured that it's not coming from T-Mobile. Uh, thank you very much for clarifying that issue. I will get this published immediately. Thank you so much. Would there be anything else, uh, Floyd, that I can help you on your T-Mobile account? Um, free service would be great, but I'm good with what I have. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go ahead and submit the feedback about it. I hope I can get free service too, but with the free advertisement that you're providing, I hope that they can hear you so they can, you know, give you like something, uh, like a little token of appreciation as oh, well, but I'll nice. propose that to my supervisor. Okay? okay. Thank you very much. I'll get this published, uh, right away. You're welcome. Y'all have, have a happy holiday. Yes. Happy holidays. And I hope you will have a wonderful year this 2024. And I hope your uh, YouTube account will be successful. Okay? Yes. You I'm going to have care. the best year of my life. You too. All right. Thank Bye. you so much. Bye-bye. And there you have it, folks. All it took was a phone call. I didn't even have to dial 10 digits. I just dialed three, 611, and got your answer for you. There you go. 100% bullshit. Fearless Floyd strikes again. Keep telling you folks. Sucks being right all the time. Like, subscribe, share, hit that notification bell, leave a comment below. Come visit me and take my dog for a walk. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, I've got to blaze out to uh, Katie real quick. So I want to get this video published. So thank you, everybody. Uh, Fierce Floyd Show at Yahoo.com, my website. Come get some of these specials. It's not too late to give for Christmas. If you have guilt and shame about not giving somebody for Christmas, hey, give them an entry into Trust Class Weepstakes. It's $1.99. Okay? It's like, like entering the lottery. You know, here's a scratch off. You got a chance to win, right? Peace in the Middle East. Let's go RVing. Hey, guess what? January 1st, 2024. What is the Rocky Dinar going to be valued at? That's the question you should ask yourself. Because if 10 pounds of coffee cost $10 US dollars now in Iraq, and January 1st, when dollars are outlawed, cannot purchase anything with dollars anymore, you have to use dinars. How much does that 10 pounds of coffee cost? I should, holding dinar? Wow. Imagine what that looks like. Happy trails, folks. I'll see you at the end of the rainbow.